you could please stand for me. Friends, we have gathered here today in the presence of God with Elijah and Jarrell to give thanks for the gift of marriage and to share in the joy of their wedding. It is an honorable estate instituted of God signifying unto us the union that is between Christ and his church, the holy estate Christ has adorned himself. Marriage is a promise of love that endures all things. Marriage, therefore, is not to be entered into lightly, for by God's word we are commanded to hold it in honor at all times. Who is giving this bride to be married to this groom? I do. Thank you. We just remain standing as we pray. Father, we thank you for this time, for this fellowship, and for this marriage. We pray, Lord God, that you will be in the midst of this ceremony. We give you the praise, the glory, and the honor in Jesus' name. Let every heart say amen. 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 You may be seated. <laughs> Jarrell, will you have this woman to be your wedded wife, to live together according to God's holy covenant of marriage? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, be faithful to her as long as you both shall live? If so, answer, I will. I will. Nemijah. Will you have this man to be your wedded husband, to live together according to God's holy covenant of marriage? Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, be faithful to him as long as you both shall live? If so, answer, I will. I will. The scripture says in 1 Corinthians 13, it says, love is patient and kind. It is not jealous or boastful or proud or rude. It does not demand its own way. It is not irritable. It keeps no record of being wrong. It does not rejoice over injustice, but rejoices whenever truth wins out. Love never gives up. Love never loses faith. It is always hopeful and it endures through every circumstance. Let someone say amen. 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 Um, I have had the honor and the privilege to counsel these two, these two, uh, these two individuals and it's truly uh, been a blessing. And I might just look at me like, if you don't hurry up, I'm ready to get this thing started.